Hi all, in this video I am going to share you guys tutorial to move your windows OS to SSD from your hard disk. So let's jump into this tutorial. So for this we are using mini tool partition wizard and you can get that application for free from the link given in the description or you can just google it and find it for yourself. The free version can easily move your windows os to ssd from the hard disk so let's jump into this tutorial uh, before we jump into this tutorial there are some things that you want to keep in mind the first thing is that the size of your os partition in my case i used 240 gigs of ssd and my partition which contain this windows os is like 310 gigs from that 310 only 130 gigs is used I prefer you guys to make your windows OS partition like this like like the partition that is having this windows OS is using less space compared to the SSD that you are moving into in that way you can avoid lot of problems that you are going to face while moving so making sure everything is in the way open this mini tool partition wizard and from the left side choose migrate os in the migrate menu there will be two options the first option will move your all the windows os to your ssd and the remaining free space on your ssd will be unallocated that is you can allocate it later but right after you move your os is going to be unlock unallocated so there is the first option and by using the second option it is going to effectively move all your windows os to this ssd and it will keep all the remaining space as the space you can use it later so i am choosing the second option press next and from the next menu choose the destination ssd choose that press next and from the partitioning menu from the copy option choose fit partition to enter disk press next after pressing finish from the mini tool partition wizard from the left side choose apply and it's going to apply all the changes that we made and in the middle of the process it will ask to restart your device as it's going to do further processing while your device boot up so do that just reboot your device and it's going to make all the changes it will take time based on the size of your os partition also based on the speed of your Hard disk. So after this process finishes, when you open your laptop again on your my computer, you can find you cannot really find any difference except there is like two OS partition on your my computer. So just reboot your device to BIOS and from BIOS boot menu change your boot order and make this SSD as your first priority. And if you got option to delete boot boot menu just delete your hard disk boot menu so after saving that in your bios just reboot your device and you can experience the blazing speed of ssd so after opening your computer in ssd we want to clean some clutter because there should be a lot of clutter after you move your files to ssd the first thing is that we want to delete the os partition from your hard disk we want to delete all other partition which is not needed for hard disk so for that open up mini tool partition wizard again and from there delete the os partition delete your system partition and delete the recovery partition and all other partition which is not needed by your hard disk don't delete from ssd just delete it from hard disk and we want to clean another clutter that is in our my computer we can find a new partition called the system partition which cannot be opened by ourselves which is not needed which is like a system file so we want to remove that for that in mini tool partition wizard choose that partition and choose change letter and change the letter to none it's going to add that partition we don't want to delete that we want we just want to add that so after that we are finished not that finished we have successfully move your OS to SSD so that's it that's all about this simple easy to follow but time consuming tutorial for moving all your OS to SSD so that's it that's all about this video guys I hope you find this video useful if you do so 
hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe